what is the derivative of x raised to the x? What is the answer to that question? In order to find the answer, we need to use a process called logarithmic differentiation. Now, in the past, I've created other videos explaining how to do that. But in this particular video, instead of going through the process, I'm just going to give you a formula that will help you go straight to the answer. By the way, if you want to see those older videos that explains the process to get the answer, feel free to check out the links in the description section below. It's going to include these examples that you see here today. So let's begin. Here's the formula you need to use. The derivative of u raised to the v is equal to u raised to v times v u prime over u plus v prime ln u. So in this example, both u and v are equal to x. So u prime and v prime, they're both one in this case. So u raised to the v is going to be the same thing that we have here x raised to the x, and then v, v is x, times u prime, which is 1, divided by u, which is x, plus v prime, v prime is 1, times ln u, where u is x. So x over x is just 1, so the answer is x raised to the x times 1 plus ln x. Again, the video in the description has this example. It shows you how to go from point A to point B, but this formula will take you straight there. Now, let's move on to the next example. Let's say we want to find the derivative of x raised to the sine x. Feel free to pause the video if you want to try this example. I'm just going to rewrite the formula real quick. So the derivative of u raised to the v is u to the v times v u prime divided by u plus v prime ln u. So first we need to determine u and v. u is x, v is sine x u prime, the derivative of x is 1, v prime, the derivative of sine x is cosine x. So now we just got to put it into the formula. So u raised to the v, it's x raised to the sine x, which is always what we start with, times v u prime. So v is sine x, u prime is 1 over u, u is sine, plus v prime, which is cosine, times ln u. u is x, so ln u is ln x. So this is the answer. It's x raised to sine x times sine x over x plus cosine x times ln x. That's all we could do for that. Feel free to try this problem. Go ahead and find the derivative of ln x raised to the x. So in this case, u is going to be ln x, v is x, u prime, the derivative of ln x is 1 over x, v prime is going to be 1. So u raised to the v. It's going to be ln x raised to the x, the original problem, and then v u prime. So v is x, u prime is 1 over x, divided by u, u is ln x, and then plus v prime, which is 1, times ln u, u being ln x, so it's ln ln x. 
Now we could simplify this. 1 over x times x, these will cancel to 1. So this is going to be ln x raised to the x times 1 over ln x plus ln ln x. So that's going to be the answer for this problem. Try this one. The derivative of x raised to the ln x. So it's basically in reverse. u this time is x, v is ln x, so u prime is going to be 1, v prime is 1 over x. So it's going to be the original problem, x raised to the ln x, and then v u prime, so v is ln x, u prime is 1, over u, u is x, plus v prime, so v prime is 1 over x, and then ln u, where u is x, so that's just ln x. So we get a completely different answer. Now, here this is ln x over x, and this is ln x over x. We can add them and get 2 ln x over x. So we could simplify our answer like this. x raised to the ln x times 2 ln x over x. So that's going to be the final answer. Now let's try this one. The derivative of x raised to the e to the x. By the way, for those of you who want a formula sheet with a list of derivatives that you may need to know for your upcoming tests, feel free to check out the links in the description section below. I have a formula sheet where you can access these derivative formulas. Now for this one, u, let's define u as x and v as the exponent e to the x. So u prime is going to be 1. The derivative of e to the x is just e to the x. So that's v prime. So it's u raised to the v. So that's the original problem. And then v u prime. So v is e to the x. u prime is 1 over u, which is x, plus v prime, which is e to the x, times ln u. So that's ln x. So now let's see if we can simplify this. In both cases, we have an e to the x. So we could factor out the GCF. So it's x e to the x. If we take out e to the x, we're left with 1 over x plus ln x. And I'm going to put that e to the x in the front here on the right side. So that's the answer for this particular problem. Let's do one more. Go ahead and find the derivative of sine x raised to the x. So we're going to make u equal to sine. v is going to be x. u prime is going to be cosine. v prime is going to be 1. So it's u to the v, the original problem, sine x raised to the x times v u prime so v is x u prime is cosine x over u u being sine x plus v prime which is 1 times ln u u is sine 
Now, cosine over sine, we can make that into cotangent. So we can write the final answer as sine x raised to the x times x cotangent x plus the natural log of sine x. So that's it for uh, that particular problem. So now you know how to perform logarithmic differentiation. You know how to get the answer using this particular formula.